Hello and welcome to another Start With A Sketch. Um, this is number seven in the series um, and um, if you've watched the previous few videos from four, five and six you'll know that I'm doing a short series where I'm using one collection pack um, or a series of sketches uh, to see if I can completely annihilate it. Um, it's the Ashbury Heights Market Street uh, collection by My Mind's Eye um, and it has nine double-sided um, uh, pattern papers um, along with a sticker sheet um, but that's it there's no other embellishments so I'm adding a few embellishments of my own and I've also added an, a number of sheets of cardstock as well along the way uh, probably about four or five um, and so far I've managed to make uh, two single layouts and one double um, and this is uh, another one and I think I'll probably get another one out of this after this one too so um, hopefully that'll be uh, six layouts or six sides altogether um, which considering there's only nine papers it's not bad um, right so this layout here I've already chosen a background sheet that's this uh, spotty background here it's got the lovely gold foiled dots I think you can just about see those uh, we'll start by trimming off the manufacturing strip now my sketch calls for one photo, a uh, large photo, and then three small photos at the bottom. Um, they don't have to be photos, they could be something else, but I happen to have three perfectly sized photos uh, that will sit nicely along the bottom in a strip uh, like that. So um, I'll probably mount those onto white card to give them a small border each. Um, and the sketch also calls for a strip of pattern paper or something underneath it. Uh, so uh, I'll find something... Um, suitable. Um, okay, so um, I've got this one photo up here that's supposed to be anchored towards the top there and it has a few paper layers behind it so I'm going to go ahead and cut out a few uh, bits and pieces. Um, right, I'm aware that the uh, sun's so started streaming through my window. Um, I'll uh, sort that out and uh, I'm going to mount these three photos on um, two white cards to give them a border and I'm going to get the edges inked of this cluster um, and stuck down. Back with that in just a moment. Okay, so uh, sunshine problem sorted there. Uh, I'm sorry about that. Um, I have uh, gone ahead and mounted my three little photos on the bottom, um, put them onto a strip of uh, blue arrows paper, and I've um, put a cluster up here. So I really try to use uh, the sketch 
So there's my photo. I've got a photo mount that's slightly bigger, um, shows on three sides, so that's this one. Um, I've got a, a larger square one behind, which, almost square, which is this blue arrows one here. Then I've added in um, this piece of red, uh, just because it needed to pop off the page a little bit, and, uh, and then a strip, um, which is actually a bit too short, so I just cut it in the middle and I've split it, so um, I've got a piece poking out my thread. I've also put a strip of washi tape under there, just to give it a bit of extra um, uh, dimension texture. So according to my um, sketch, um, I need a title um, under here, um, which is what I'm going to add next. I have these fantastic stickers uh, called Notebook and I love the fact that they're um, sketched and this is a messy play um, day so um, those uh, letters go really well. So. Right, okay, title down. I also have a geo tag that came in the um, thicker set, which I want to use, but not quite sure where I'm going to put it yet, so I'll just put it on the front for now. Um, I've um, got three areas of embellishment on the sketch. One here, I think I might add a flare badge there. Um, one over here and one down here. So I would like to um, use some more of this washi tape. I'm going to put a piece here, and I was going to put a piece vertically there, but I've got it vertical there, so I thought maybe I'll do it horizontally instead, but actually, no, I think I am going to go vertical. It's only going to be very small up there. Okay, so I've got my three areas. Actually, I'm going to add another bit of washi to this corner. And I quite like this one as well. So I might add just a little bit. just down there. Okay. Okay. Um, can I go back to the stickers to see if I can find um, anything on here that will work on my layout. I'm going to use the date. I think I'll pop that over in this this side over here. I might need to put something else underneath it, but if I do I'll just peel that sticker up. And like happy days is this way, and that's quite cool. I think I'll put that under there. Um, I love to say cheese, but I'm not sure where I'm going to fit it in. Possibly down there. Yep, I quite like it there. Thought it might be too big, but actually, I quite like it. Um, now I've got all these words on here, I love you so very much, that's a great day, uh, record, record, noted, um, all my favourite things, so I think I might try and add a few of those in, I quite like the idea of um, putting a few along this bit up here. Um,
and I'd like to get some um, journaling in. I think this background white paper might be a bit hard to work uh, write on, especially because it's got the gold foil and um, the, the um, I'd have to use a stick writer the whole time, which I don't always like to do. Um, so I wonder if I can find a journaling card that will fit nicely in there. I might cut it up and cut something up into strips. Actually, that might be a better option rather than use journaling cards. Yeah, I think I'll do that. So I can easily write on red card and it brings the cut ties the colour scheme in really nicely. So I'm gonna cut those into um, different strips. Okay, so um, I've got all my um, journaling um, down. Um, so I stuck all the strips down and then I wrote on the journaling. Um, I ran out of space just at the end, so I had to move this little one so it was next to this one instead of underneath and add one other long one there. Um, but otherwise, um, I was pretty spot on. Um, I've um, added in my geotag up here. Um, and I've stamped live free a few times on the layout. Um, and I wanted to get in just a couple of last little bits of embellishment before I call this one finished. So I have a star from the um, Thicker's sticker sheet that matches the geotag that's up there. And I have a bracket as well, which I thought I might um, just pop on there like that. Yep. Um, and um, finally, I wanted to finish off by adding in a few enamel dots that are not enamel dots. They're puffy stickers. Um, but they look like enamel dots, <laughs> so uh, just gonna dot a couple around. One. I don't. I'd like a dark blue, but I don't have one, unfortunately. So I'm going to stick with uh, with what I've got, which is turquoisey one. I'm just going to drop a few bits. As it was messy play, I thought I'd get messy with some ink. Kind of going on a diagonal across the layout this way, but also I added some up here as well. I don't mind it going over my photos on this occasion. I do that sometimes, but this one I do not mind. Okay, so I'm going to um, call that one uh, finished. And uh, there is the original sketch, and I've stayed pretty close to it. Um, so thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.